Hi guys, it's very easy to change one color to another. I have a tutorial for that. But what if you want to colorize a white subject? In this tutorial, I'll talk about how to turn a white to any color, even black. Stay with me and I'll show you. Here we have a girl with white shirt. And when turn a white to any color, it's very important to make a perfect selection of the white subject. In our case, the shirt. You can use any preferred method, uh, maybe quick selection tool, object selection tool. I prefer to use pen tool and I'll make a selection with a pen tool. I'll speed a little bit because it's too boring. The selection is done. Make selection. Let's make further radius one pixel. Okay. And I'll save that selection. White shirt. Okay. And I suggest you every time when you make some hard or time consuming selection to save it because if you messed up something, you can or the save selection. Now when we have the selection, let's create a new solid color layer. Let's pick the desired color, let's say some red color. Click OK and change the blend mode to multiply. Now it's way more better, but it's still a little bit fat. We need to create a new curse adjustment layer, but before that, because we will need the mask also on the adjustment layer, Let's create a new group. Let's put the solid color layer inside of the group and move the mask on the group. Now this mask will count for all layers inside of the group. Now we can create a new curse adjustment layer and let's make it a little bit dark and a little bit white. I think it's good, but it's still not perfect. To make it perfect, we need to have some shiny elements on the cloth. Let's create a new curse adjustment layer. Now let's make it way more white. Maybe something like this. And let's play with the blend if option. To do that, double click on the right of the layer. And on the blend if field, on the underlying layer, pick the left arrow and move it to the right. Do you see? But now it's too harsh. To make it smoother, hold the outer option key and separate the arrow and play with the separated arrow to make the perfect color. Maybe something like this. Okay, let's see. Now it's way more better. Now, if you want to change the color, just return to the solid color layer and change it to any color that you like. It. But what if you want to make it black color? You have to notice that the black quotes are not pure black. Uh, if you look at my mic, it's not a pure black. If you use the pure black, it will be not natural. Let me show you. Let's return to the solid color layer and let's use a pure black. It's not natural. That's why you have to choose a little bit gray color, maybe somewhere here. Now it's way more natural. If you zoom a little bit, we see that the mask is not perfect. You can repair that, return to the mask on the group and just repair the mask. You have to be very gentle. I'll not repair the wall mask because I want to show you the method. And let's see again. Red color, black color, maybe blue color, any color. The tutorial is a little bit advanced, but it's not so hard. If you follow the steps carefully, we're not problem to do it. 
I hope you like it. Subscribe with the bell for more videos and see you soon.